I'm Charmaine Major and I'm a bus driver for Arriva in West Yorkshire. So I got into bus driving by accident. I was working a job that I really didn't like, wealth and education. My a cousin was an uncle. He was a bus driver and he was like, just apply, like you'll never know. But at the time, like I didn't think I would get the position because I didn't see a lot of females bus driving, especially not young females. Like, but I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna apply. Like I absolutely love driving. Like it's a dream job for me. So I applied and I got through the whole process and then yeah, I'm here six years later. I literally get to drive around so many different areas and places and see like so many different beautiful things. Like the best thing is seeing the sunrises and the sunsets. At the depot that I work at, there's over 100 routes and there's a lot of them that go down like nice country roads. So you get to see like just so many nice landscapes. Yeah. It's so beautiful. Like you know the things that you take for granted. I know it sounds so silly, but like the change in the seasons and the way the trees look and the sky looks, all the different seasons just bring so many different beautiful things. Yeah, so I just basically started on TikTok when lockdown started and I just thought I'm not seeing any other bus drivers on there and I thought it was a good way to show people that there's more to bus drivers than just just what you'd think because you don't realise like how much there is to a job and the, all the behind the scenes um, and I think it showed people a lot more of the job than you'd ever ever see. Like you just think you're getting a bus and drive but there's just so much behind it which I've, I go over so much in my um, TikTok videos. I literally love it so much. I've always worked customer facing roles. I don't think I could do anything else. Um, I just love meeting people from all different backgrounds, all walks of life. Like you, every single person that gets on a bus is different. They've all got a different story. And like sometimes I find myself just wondering what their life's like. And like, when I started bus driving, my vision of a bus driver was like an old, miserable male driver. I mean, joining, as soon as I joined, I realized that was so wrong. Like. It, it weren't right at all. The only thing that I can say is anybody can be a bus driver, like it doesn't matter like what age you are, your, your sexual orientation, your race, your religion, literally anybody can do the job. If I'm sitting behind the wheel, then I'm fully qualified to drive the bus, I'm safe to drive the bus. Like in my first like four or five years, I know I've only been doing it over six and a half years, but I had a lot more comments like about being such a young female bus driver and people were saying that I'm too attractive to be in a job, but when it's a job that I love, like it's for anybody, do you know what I mean? So I think it's it's changing, like times are changing and the more people see that like in the media, on social media, I think it'll encourage that younger people and more females to hopefully apply. I think like my TikTok has really helped a lot of people. Like I get so many messages from um, females and young people in general saying because of your TikTok, like I've applied to be a bus driver and like people send me pictures and videos when they've passed and it literally just warms my heart. Like it's weird that it's humbling that I'm that person that's helped so many young people and females like apply for the role and for, for them to like send me pictures and videos, like I get emotional. So I'd say to anybody that wanted to become a bus driver that doesn't fit the stereotype, just go for it. Like, all you can do is go for it. You'll, you're gonna do your six weeks training, just like everybody else. You're gonna build your confidence and you're gonna meet like so many amazing people that are gonna build you up.